To begin the firmware update process, go to unique.com. Once on the Unique homepage, click on the Products tab. Click on the image of the Typhoon H. This will take you to the Typhoon H overview page. Once on the overview page, select the Downloads tab, which will direct you to the Downloads page. Once on the Downloads page, a list of the most recent firmware will be available for you to download. It is important to note that each unique product has its own downloads page that can be accessed from each product's overview page. To download the firmware for the Typhoon H, click on Link 1 for United States or click on Link 2 for Europe. The file should automatically begin to download to your system. We will now begin the process of installing the firmware onto the Typhoon H. Insert the micro SD card into the adapter, and then insert the adapter into your computer. Both the micro SD card and the adapter are included in your package. Locate the downloaded firmware file on your computer and copy it to the micro SD card. Once complete, remove the micro SD card from the computer and adapter. Then insert it into the bottom of the Seago 3 Plus camera. Next, power on the ST16 transmitter. Then, power on the Typhoon H. It is important to note that the ST16 transmitter must always be powered on before the Typhoon H. Once the Wi-Fi connection has been established, proceed with selecting the System Settings option. Select OK to exit the telemetry warning notification. Select About Controller. Select Update in the Typhoon H section. Select OK to continue. Please allow two to three minutes for the update process to complete. Once the update is successful, select OK. Next, power off the Typhoon H. It is important to double check the update has been successful before attempting to fly again. It is important to wait two to three seconds before powering on again. Once the Wi-Fi connects and a picture appears on the screen, Select the System Settings option. Select OK to exit the telemetry warning notification. Select About Controller. Verify that the firmware has been updated to the latest version by viewing the version under Typhoon H. Your update is now complete. Enjoy your next flight.